Speared home today's city council meeting featured an appearance by a former city council member who spearheaded the Air Street Improvement Project. Remember that? Brian Burns joins us now with more on today's uh, city council events. Brian. Well, Rudy, it was Priscilla Leal who introduced and fought long and hard for upgrades to that dangerous stretch of airs and was on hand today as the project contract was awarded. Leal appeared as council was voting to approve the more than $11 million project to provide sidewalks and the widening of airs between Galahar and SPID. Leal suffered two strokes five years ago in the middle of her last term on council at the beginning of her last term. The strokes left her unable to speak. Accompanied by former mayor Nelda Martinez, along with her husband and family, Leal was brought to council in a wheelchair. Through a friend, Leal thanked those who helped get the project designed and approved. Priscilla spent many hours on airs and project, Air Street project. First, she would like to thank um, Diana Sepulveda for her help, Roland Barrera for inviting her um, to be here today, for all her family, husbands and friends, and especially Amir Martinez, uh, for always being her friends and, and supporting her and helping her pass this um, uh, projects that she had behind her. Leal indicated she would still be serving her final term today if not for the stroke she suffered. The Air Street Improvement Project will add sidewalks and a turn lane along with curb, gutter and underground utility improvements. And that project is expected to be completed by October of next year. Now, meantime, City Manager Peter Zanoni outlined the proposed $1.1 billion city budget for next year, which includes more money for roads, more police and firefighters, and we'll have the highlights coming up at 6. Rudy? Thanks, Brian, for that.